Greetings ladies and gentlemen, my name is Anify20 and welcome back to The Legend of Zelda Twilight Princess. In the last episode, I believe we made it here to Zora's Domain. We thawed out the frozen Zoras with a big piece of rock that we s took from the Goron Mountain, up in Death Mountain. And we've begun hunting for the Tears of Light. Now there's one back in Hyrule Castle. So we're going to take this stream and ride it down to Hyrule Field. Which will deposit us here. You may recognize this place. So, we're going to now run around. Get through here. Get out of here, you stupid idiot. I'm going the wrong way. Get out of here, bird. How did you bite me? You have no face. Alright, this way. Go away. Those are supposed to be bulblins, I think. Either that or the bark hoblins. I think they're... I think they're bulblins. Or maybe both of bulk bokoblins and bulblins turn into those. I mean, there's no differentiation. Well, if we come down here, you may see the golden wolf there. Unfortunately, we can't do anything with him because we need to be a human to get that. But we can't. What the? Hi. Get out of my face. Okay, get rid of you. Now we can these two. Fine then. with all of you at once. You want to be like that. Yeah, we now have a new portal. Useful. Give me that heart. Alright, across the bridge. You have to find this bug. Apparently, this bug is down by Telma's bar. Just come down here. And into this region. See you. Gotcha, you loser. Okay, so. Now we need to warp back down here. Or rather, we can just warp to Castle Town. Take the shortcut out. Here. Ta da! And then we just run back down to Lake Hylia.
Now, I'm not sure if this is faster or slower than warping back to... The, um... Boink. Gotcha. Whether this is faster or slower to warping back to Zora's domain and riding the river down. I also don't think the, f the bridge is on fire anymore. Which is good. The box is probably gone, though. Yeah, the box is gone. So we can't jump off the side this way. Let's see. How do we get down below? Probably right here. Right? Can I jump over this? Hmm. Do I have to warp down there? Hmm. What's well, down here? That is a wall? <laughs> that is a wall. We cannot go that way. Well, I guess I have to warp back to Zora's Domain and float down. They're forcing me into this... Fine. Yeah, warp me to Zora's Domain. Okay, into the water we go. Run, swim. Oop, climb out. That's annoying. Hop. Ride the river. Ride the river. Shame I can't ride the river all the way. I'm actually forced to ride the bird. Which is obnoxious. Yeah, because both sides of that are blocked off. One goes through there, and the other one goes through the other one. Come get me. I wish you could just skip this transportation segment. It's ridiculous. Can I just skip this, please? Is there a button to skip this? Is there? No. No button to skip. I guess we're flying then. Stay low. Take the corner sharp. Get through this as fast as we can. I probably should have gone to the high roll. Wait, Hyrule Castle was down here, wasn't it? No, it wasn't. I should have gone to Hyrule Castle first and then rode the bird down. But then again, I also missed the last bug when I was flying down the first time. You can't hit me, losers. Seriously, if you get shot by one of those arrows, you've got a problem. I don't think I've ever gotten shot by one of those arrows getting shot at me. Alright, get 
me out of here. I don't want to be here anymore. Okay. So our last... Let me stop that. Alright. So our last... Uh... Oop, there's one. Our last... Uh... Tears of Light. are in this region. Let's swim over here. Onto this low island thing. Hello. What was that thing? What are you talking about? What, my giant bird? I mean, yeah, it's big, but... Hey! Get back here. Gotcha. Alright. Oh. Okay, we're doing this again? Honestly, probably should have done this first. Gotcha. Come on, you two. Get close together. There we go. Hmm, there's something over there. See it in the background? Alright, warp point. Now then, our last tier is right... Excuse me. Hey, get back here. So yeah, maybe I shouldn't have done this one the last. So if you finish this somewhere else, this is not your la that was not your last tier, last in quotation marks. Uh, Midna would pop in and say, "Hey, what's up? Where's the last tier? What's up with this thunderstorm?" Uh, and then all of a sudden, this glowing light would appear on your map and be like, hey, there it is. We should go get it. And it would lead you over here to this random bit of flotsam just sort of floating in the river here, or in the lake. All right. What's going on here? Uh, hello? Hello? Ladies and gentlemen, giant space flea from nowhere. This here is basically a queen shadow bug. Get in the water. There it goes. Here it comes. All right. There's like there is some kind of insect that this is supposed to be representing. I forget what it is. Get out of here. This one isn't going to go down without a fight. I think this is supposed to be like a termite. Do termite queens look like this? Whoa. Hello. Gotcha. 
And now it's floating, so we jump in the water, climb on top of it, and do one of these. And that is the coup de gras on the Shadowbug Queen. I still think this thing should have provided more than one tier of light. There we go. Like, have it provide the last three or something. Anyway. The vessel of light is full of tears and light has returned to this area. You make sure to get that last few shadow now. Hee <laughs> hee. See you later. And Lanayru takes the form of a massive serpent. My name is Lenebru. Your efforts have at last restored each of us light spirits in Hyrule. O oh, hero chosen by the gods, the dark power that you seek, it waits in a temple set in the bed of Lake Hylia. But before seeking it, you must now bear witness to something and never forget it. You must know that it was the will of the goddesses that we lock away the forbidden power. Brace yourselves. When all was chaos, the goddesses descended and gave order and life to the world. They granted power equally to all who dwelt in the light, and then returned to the heavens. The lands where the goddesses descended came to be known as the Sacred Realm. For ages the people lived at ease, content in mind and body. But soon word of the Sacred Realm spread through Hyrule, and a great battle ensued. Among those living in the light, interlopers who excelled at magic appeared. Wielding powerful sorcery, they tried to establish dominion over the sacred realm. It was then that the goddesses ordered us three light spirits to intervene. We sealed away the great magic those individuals had mastered. <laughs> you know this magic. It is the dark power you seek, the fused shadow. O oh, hero chosen by the goddesses, beware. Those who do not know the danger of wielding power will, before long, be ruled by it. Never forget that.
The dark power that you seek is within the sleeping lake bed temple in Lake Hylia. That is usually considered one of the creepiest and weirdest cutscenes in any Zelda game. Or pretty much any game, really. Or at least any game released by Nintendo. The symbolism there is so thick you could cut it with a knife. Anyway. Lake Hylia is back to normal. And we can now walk around, and we see there's a portal up in the sky. If I can go into first-person mode, there it is. And we need to restore... Or we need to find a way to get into the lake bed temple. However, there's no way that we can dive down there and be able to breathe for long enough. However, we can now speak to the various NPCs here. I'm a member of the Zora tribe, the proud people who care for Lake Hylia. The other Zoras are all on guard patrol at the bottom of the lake. Okay. Well, let's have a word with uh, you. Well, some of the Zoras are still alive down under there. I thought maybe they dried up along with the lake. Hey, buddy, have you heard? There's like a temple or something at the bottom of this lake. They put on such airs with all their rituals and fancy temple hoo-ha. Then they just disappear. And what's with putting that temple so deep that humans can't swim there? I swear those Zoras. Oh, are you a customer? <laughs> You're one lucky fella, fella. The height of excitement, the thrill of launching to the heavens, the very peak of flying, flying fantastication. It can be yours, fellow, without a, for a limited time only, and without waiting in line for a paltry... It's a paltry 10 rupees. What do you say, buddy of mine? Want to give it a shot? Sure. Welcome, fella, and right this way. So I just stand in here? Oh, that's a cannon. Uh, where are you shooting me exactly? Oh, boy. Oh, we're up here now. Okay. Whoa, that reminds me of something. Didn't the late queen in Zora's domain ask you to do something? She asked us to find her son, the one who's been missing since he headed for Hyrule Castle. I think she said something about granting you some special power if you rescued him? If the final piece of the f of Fused Shadow is on the bottom of Lake Hylia, then it looks like we're gonna need to going to need that ability. Yes, indeed. So, let's just... Okay, I can't do that. How about I jump back here? There we go. There's a lot of cuckoos in here. So, we just need to head out the door. And now, all of the twilight is gone. So, the skies are blue once more. And we should probably head off to Hyrule Castle Town and reunite with Ilya. That's a Gwei. That's also a Gwei. Gotcha. Nothing? Really? Fine. Hey, Pona. Hey, Pona. Let's go. Turn us around and take us onward. Actually, let's, uh... How do I... What am I doing? Here we go. Alright, off we go. Probably should pick those up. <laughs> oh well. Anyway, we're gonna ride through here now. 
and completely bypass that area that we actually need to go through. So we're going to have to go through that area anyway. more I have now. Off we go. Alrighty. So, down from there. Whoa, wait a minute. Hold up. Is that a bug I saw? It is a bug I saw. Hey, bug. How about you get down here? I, hmm. Oh, there he goes. He's flying. These guys need to go away. Uh, wait a minute. Wait a minute. Hold up. Out of here. Hey, bug. Hey. Mr. Link, wait! <laughs> now what? <sighs> Greetings, Mr. Link. I have come to deliver a letter. There's a letter for you, Link. Two letters, in fact. Thank you. Well, my business is concluded. Onward to mail. Thanks. Who's sending me mail now? Barns. Good stuff inside. We finally finished production on a new type of bomb. These ones can be used in water. We have them in stock now. Come by and pick yours up. Barns of Kakariko. Huh. And the Lanayru Tourist Association has prepared a grand tour of natural splendor. Our current main attraction is Iza and Hina's Playground for Grown-Ups. You'll find both immediately down the river bank from the Zora Waterfall Pool. Iza's Rapid Ride. Shoot at targets while riding the raging river rapids. No extra charge for using bomb arrows. Hina's Fishing Hole. It's a fight against nature with, luring, with lure fishing. What kind of fish can you catch? We look forward to seeing you there. Huh. Interesting. Cool. Oh, there's a bunch of them. And now there isn't. And remember what I said about the Gways. Alright, let's grab these rupees then. Now, where's that bug? Bug! 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 You caught a male stag beetle. Bug fans love that golden color. Check out caught bugs on the collection screen. Cool. Alrighty then. So, let us... Right on. As it happens, we have something else we can do here. I think we might be doing that in this episode. Yeah, these are bulb ones. Hello. We'll do this the last thing that we need. Up here. Leave my horse alone. <sighs> and here we are once again. We meet again. You have a little more of the look of a hero than you did before. Do you feel ready to earn your next skill? I do. Very well. But before we begin, I must test you test you to ensure you have mastered the last skill I taught you, the ending blow. Now then, come at me. Ending blow. Excellent. It appears you are certainly capable of performing my lost art. Very well. My second skill is the shield attack. Let it be hewn into your mind. Hidden skill, shield attack. 
No matter how well-tempered a blade is, if a, foe, if a foe is clad in armor and bears a shield, the sword will do it no harm. When facing such a foe, you must use ZR to thrust your shield against the defenses of your enemy, causing the fiend to recoil. Use ZL to lock onto me, and then try it. You have learned much, so I am sure you can see the moment when you can do a shield attack. Excellent. Open a hole in your enemy's defenses and use your sword to strike without hesitation. The shield attack I have just taught you can be also be used to repel an enemy's projectile attacks. Would you practice? Then repel my magical attack with your shield attack. Oop, missed. You cannot reflect my spell back toward me unless you press ZR just as it hits your shield. There we go. Perfect. When your enemies assail you with projectiles, this is how you will defeat them with ease. Done. You have learned the second of my hidden skills, the shield attack. You will learn the second hidden skill, the shield attack. Walk on to a foe with ZL and press ZR to thrust your shield, dazing your enemy. But I have five more secrets to teach you in time. The path to becoming the true hero is a long one. But once you have grasped all of the hidden skills, you shall be worthy of walking it. You must persist on the lonely path of the sword to obtain true courage and earn the strength to conquer the great evils of the world. Do not forget your discipline with the blade before we meet again. And there we go. We now have a shield attack. I think I can perform on this guy real quick. Oh, you've got a... No, I can't attack this guy. Because he's got a bow! Get out of here! Alright. Well, anyway, next time in The Legend of Zelda, Twilight Princess, we're going to take our first steps into Hyrule Castle Town as a human. Till then, this is Xana520, signing out.